right now. Hey, good people. How y'all doing out there? It's Brown Bag Tarot. If you're new here, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. All right. About to tear open a bag. All right. Now, I didn't know whose bag it was going to be. I was going to let fate decide. Now, y'all saw me shuffling my cards, and this one flew out. So, I guess Spirit got a message for the Cancer. Respect your feelings, it says. All right. Respect yourself. Da, 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 da. Mm -mm. Respect yourself. Boop, boop, boop. All right, Cancer. Spirit got something to tell you. I feel like it's important because that card just flew out. I didn't even have time to say my little spiel. Spirit is like, mm, on with the show. Cut to the chase. Respect your feelings, Cancer. Let's see what this is about. Thank you, Spirit. What you got for the Cancer? Holy Spirit, what you want to say to the Cancer? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's do this. Mwah. While I'm shuffling, y'all, hit that like button for me. Subscribe if you haven't. Tell a friend. Do. Alright, that one hit the floor. That must be really important. Uh oh, lightning. Two. Three. Disruption. Five. Change. Hmm. All right. Relationships. Knots. And peace and harmony. What the cancer? The fuck? Focus. Bullseye. Boom. Respect your feelings. All right. So I feel like cancer. This is you. Oh, you, you. You got yourself into some little tizzy, huh? You done caught, got yourself caught up in some shit. Hmm. I feel like there is not peace and harmony in some of your relationships. Okay. I feel like you do want peace and harmony in your relationships, but some of your relationships are in knots, okay? I feel like that you, I heard go along to get along. I feel like you not being true to yourself, okay, by... You're not, you're not being true to yourself. Because cause, cause, cause it came out and said, respect your feelings. All right? And the first thing come out here is disruption, lightning. You know, again, before lightning strike, it's a rumbling. You know, it's that thunder. Thunder claps, boom, then the lightning strikes. Okay? So I feel like it's some rumbling going on in there with you. And the rumbling, I feel like, is you not respecting your feelings. Okay, maybe you're not speaking up on something or whatnot. Okay, but I feel like you're about to speak it. All right, I feel like you haven't, maybe you didn't speak it because it's going to affect your relationships. You know, it could be some close relationships that you have, you know, that is going to be disrupted. Okay, when, 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 when you begin to respect your feelings. Okay. I feel like you want your relationships to remain peaceful and harmonious. And as long as you go along to get along, then you're going to be in knots, but your relationships are going to be harmonious. But I feel like that if you respect your feelings and disrupt the relationship, it's going to put it in knots and it's not going to be peace and harmony. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Now that's just like a general overview. Let's get into this. Let's get into this. What is going on here, spirit? Okay, what is going on here? But it's some rumbling going on. Is 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 lightning about to strike? Okay, 
your relationships are going to be affected, right? Either you're going to remain peaceful, being tied up and disrupted, or your relationships are going to be affected because you respected your own feelings. Uh-oh. Bullseye. Focus. Tell me about this lightning, this disruption, Spirit, please. Thank you. Holy Spirit, tell me about this disruption, please. One. Mm hmm Two. Mm hmm Three. Whoa. Look at that. Ooh. Temptation. See, I told you, you all tied up. Some trying to pull you down into the dark side. Pow. Look at that. Mm. Mm -mm. Look at that. I feel like cancer rules the heart. The heart space, I believe. I, I, I believe that's how it goes. Gemini rules the arms, the central nervous system. Okay. Leo's rule the back. And the Virgos rule the stomach. Yes, cancer rules the heart. If if you notice, well, you may not be able to notice, but this guy being pulled down into the dark side, damn glare. Okay, his heart space is like closed off. You may not, I don't even know why I'm doing it. You can't even see it. Anyway, his heart space is closed off and there's the key. You see, the key is a whole heart. The heart space is closed off. And it's no wonder you got this rumbling going on in you. Okay? The part of the body that you actually rule, you know, the thing that is affected whenever anything go wrong with you specifically, Cancer, is your heart. Okay? Your heart is closed off. You've thrown away the key to your heart by not respecting your own feelings. Look at that shit. Mm, mm, mm. Because you being pulled down into the dark side. Some trying to pull you into the dark side, cancer. Are you gonna let him? Hmm? Hmm? And it's like a one one way, you know, the he facing forward, but then another way, he reaching for that key. Like, man, shit. I can't I can't get pulled down into this shit. I can't. Let me grab this key and unlock my heart. Let me be true to myself. Let me respect my feelings. I got to transform. I feel like right now you in this black, dark space, you know, all uh, caterpillared, you know, cocooned off from the world or whatnot. But you're like, nah, man, she is. And I got to emerge. And if you look at her, she covered in green. That represents heart space action. Okay? Heart space. I miss she it. I, 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 I got to renew my heart. I got to open up my heart space. This shit has got me fucked up, okay? If I don't respect my feelings, this shit going to take me under. It's going to take me under. So I'm trying to pull you under, cancer, okay? Disruption. Hmm. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, so you feel like it's time to transform. And you know it. You know it. You know it. Love begins. What comes out of the heart? Love. Love begins. Okay? When you begin to respect your feelings, love begins. Again, your heart, your heart space can be opened again. Okay? I feel like the disruption is, is that whatever is trying to pull you down, you're going to be like, I can't do this no more. I'm not going to the dark side. May the force be with you, Cancer. Okay? Because this is what it is. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's clear to me. It started off with this. Being pulled into the dark side. Coming out of the dark. Coming out of the dark. Into this. You see that transformation? Being in complete darkness. Coming out of the darkness. Into the light. And you know it. You know you need to. Because if you don't. You are going to get pulled down into the darkness and you're going to be destroyed. I ain't burning bread on nobody, okay? I'm not I'm telling you what the card says. That's it. That's it. Okay? It is looking pretty obvious to me. 
right? And this this lightning, this disruption card here, you know, is is 41, which boiled down to a five. Five is about change. And this change needs to happen suddenly because this here. The lightning then struck the wing of the plane. Now, the plane is 30,000 feet above air, okay? And the lightning then struck the wing, and the plane cannot stay up in the air. We got to land this plane right here, right motherfucking now, right now, okay? And I know you might be dealing with a Taurus, but I was um, saying in another reading that it, I might have to land this plane on the freeway. On the cornfield, I might not even make it back to the airport. I may not make it to the next airport. Okay, I'm, I just might have to land this right here, smack dab in the middle of the freeway, wherever I could safely land this plane right here. Oh, I, it's coming down. That's it. I, I I can't keep the plane up no more. So I feel like, uh, Cancer, you saying I I can't do this no more. No matter how it's going to affect my relationships, okay, I, I, I can't do this no more. I'm being pulled down into the damn dark side, and I don't want to, okay? I don't want to. Y'all got my heart all closed off, got me being all mean, nasty, and contrary and shit. I don't get down like that. I don't like that. It don't feel good. No. I don't want to. Ooh, heart space right there on the bottom. I can't make this up. Y'all see me shuffle these cards? This is all about your heart. It could be physically or it could be emotionally, but it's definitely energetically. Come on, man. What? Thank you, spirit. Listen, it's about your relationships in knots. You going to be in knots or your relationship going to be in knots? I'm, I'm putting this one right there too. Bam, right there. Tell me about the relationship, spirit. One, whoa, base chakra, solitude. You're going to be like, damn, if I go back to being my loving, gentle person, working out of a genuine heart space, am I going to end up by myself? Emotional loss. Am I going to lose my relationships? Am I? Damn. Obstacles and challenges. Two fives. Told you, change is here. Change is here. Either you're going to be changed, Cancer, and get sucked down into the dark side, okay? Or are you going to change and be who you really are, respect your own feelings, okay? And change. A change is here. The plane got to land, all right? It has to land. It's going to land on the dark side or it's going to land in the light. Is the, is the plane going to crash and burn? Okay, because the plane is coming down, period. The plane has been struck by lightning, change, boom. A change has happened. The wing done got struck, disruption. Some shit done went down or whatever, and a hey, change is upon us. So either... This plane going to crash and burn with you in it, or you are going to land this plane somewhere safely. You landing the plane safely means that you may have to go against some relationships. Or, fuck it, everybody can go down with the plane. It's really up to you at this point. Okay? Choice is yours, Cancer. All right. Emotional loss. Yeah. It's going to separate you between some people because we got solitude right here. A Virgo may be involved. OK. Um, a Scorpio may be involved. Um, a Gemini or a Virgo may be involved. Temptation. That's Capricorn. They may be involved. That just these are the majors that are on the table. OK. Um, yeah. It may separate you in some of your relationships. It may put your relationships in knots. It may cause a, a conflict in your relationships. It may cause some people to draw back from you. Okay? It may cause some obstacles, some challenges. All right? But whatever it is, it's definitely affecting your heart and energy space. I tell you that. It's also affecting your foundation too. Yeah? Moving right along. 
What is this peace and harmony? Like I said, it's one of two things. Either you can have peace and harmony within your relationships by being pulled down into the dark side, or you can have peace and harmony in yourself, okay, within yourself by being true to you, which means that you may upset some of your relationships. Let's talk about it. One. That's two. What is this about spirit? What is this about spirit? Three. Two of cups. There you are again. Your relationships. You know, spiritual union. You know, there it is. Your relationships. The, the, the relationships that are that are most important to you, Cancer. And, and the relationship that should be most important to you is a relationship you got with yourself. That's why the card said, respect your feelings, yours. You know, so it's either respect the relationship you have with yourself. Can you live with yourself, Cancer? Huh? Well, can you? When you look in the mirror, what do you see? Do you see somebody you can't recognize? Do you see somebody you don't like? Or do you want to look in the mirror and see somebody that you can live with? Okay? Huh. Choice is yours. Solar plexus. With the heartache and loss. This is about separation. There you go. Right there on the bottom. Triumph. Okay? There you go. Right there. Right there. Triumph. You want to be triumphant, Cancer? Do you, huh? Well, triumph how? You want to be triumphant in the dark side? Or do you want to be triumphant by having to maybe put some separation between some people? You know? Hmm. It's up to you. I feel like that if you are true to yourself... And respect your own feelings. That is going to upset some people. That is going to put some knots in your relationship. That may cause some disharmony within some of your relationships. It will disrupt some of your relationships. It may put you in isolation. And you know this. Okay? But if you don't, Cancer... Then, here's, here's the alternative. Then you just get sucked down into the dark side. You become something that you don't recognize or like. All right? So you got to be true to yourself. Respect yourself. Mm, okay? Because some disruption is taking place. Change is upon us. It is. Okay. We got a five right here. Disruption. That's a five. We got a five right here with emotional loss. Oh, damn. I done lost my relationships. All right. Well, it's better than losing yourself. Okay. Oh, obstacles and challenges. Oh, I, I, I. That, that water represents emotion down there. This is deep. It's emotional. It is. But you can stay on this side and get sucked down into the darkness. Or you can go on and cross this emotional challenging bridge and go on about your business. Five. You choose. Cancer choice is yours. It is. Okay. It is. Okay. It is. And you know what to do. Heart chakra and the magician. All right, that's a five. You know what's up. You are aware of, you see that? Awareness. Bing! You're aware of what needs to happen. You're aware. Okay? So again, you can come on into the marvelous light. Okay? And let love begin. Heal your heart space. Okay? Okay? By putting some separation between you and some of these relationships. Or you can get sucked down into the darkness. Okay. You better grab that key. And unlock your heart. And then get on the good foot. And get the hell on up out of whatever it is you trapped in. 
I'm just saying, the choice is yours. You can do whatever you want to do. But right now, Cancer, I feel like spirit is, 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 has, will be disrupting you, your emotional heart space. I feel like spirit is going to be challenging you to make a choice, to choose yourself, to respect your feelings, to not get sucked down into the darkness, which means disrupting your relationships that you find near and dear that are not healthy, you know, or get sucked down into the darkness with these unhealthy relationships. It's really up to you. Respect yourself. Respect your feelings, you know, and get some peace and harmony in yourself or keep peace and harmony in your disruptive relationships and suffer. Choice is yours. So listen, listen. This is what I got for the cancer right here, right? Respect yourself. Mm. Okay. <laughs> anyway, this brown bag tarot over here. I'm tearing open people bags. I don't know what's going to come out of them, but we're going to figure it out. We're going to put it right here on the table and see what the hell is in these bags. We unpacking today. All right. So listen, if you like this message, hit that like button for me. Okay. If, if you didn't, hell, hit the dislike button. Y'all put me in the algorithm. All right. Listen, subscribe if you haven't. If this resonates with you, leave a comment. I'd appreciate the feedback. But uh, until the next time we get together, good people, over here at Brown Bag Tarot, I encourage y'all to pack light and y'all be cool.